Hey, welcome back. Or if it's your first time on my channel, welcome to you. I'm making this video because, well, I am lying. My eyesight is so bad. How bad is it, Dominique? My eyesight is so bad that I went for a routine optometrist appointment just to check up on my eyes before I left Canada. And what was supposed to be as simple as, hey, you need a deeper prescription, turned into, I need to rush you to the ER because you have holes in your retina and need emergency laser eye surgery to patch them back up. I don't know if you've ever heard of this. I certainly didn't hear about this before it happened to me, but your eye has two layers. And if one layer rips off, you're blind for life. And apparently mine was really soft and was on the verge of ripping. So from the optometrist's office, they rushed me to the hospital and did laser eye surgery to patch it back up. So my eyes just suck. Um, I don't go to the uh, eye doctor as often as I should. I think you're supposed to go um, every one to two years, depending on how bad your eyes are. I'm supposed to go at least once a year. But every time I go, it's more and more bad news. My eyes just get worse and worse, which is typical. You know, as you grow older, your eyesight gets worse. But from a very young age, my eyesight started to go down, started to degrade. It sucks, all right? So I'm making this video on hacks that I use to be able to see. Because I can't afford to keep buying new glasses all the damn time, buy a new solution, buy new contacts, all this nonsense that comes with having bad eyesight. So check out these hacks that I have for you. Okay, so this one, this is pretty common. A lot of people have mentioned this before. Um, it's using your cell phone's camera to see what the hell's going on around you. So I often just like, if I'm too lazy to reach on my glasses, I'll pick up my phone, zoom into whatever it is I need to see, and things suddenly become clearer around me. I especially use this when I'm sitting at home, my husband doing whatever it is he's doing on his, his uh, computer. And I'll just, you know, check up on, make sure he's behaving a little bit. Just zoom in. Who are you looking at? Who are you texting? Who's in our DMs? Who's talking to us? Because we are one now. Ain't nobody sliding in your DMs. It's our DMs. So any DM you get should be on my phone as well. Anyway, so that's hack number one. Hack number two. So, uh, like I mentioned before, having glasses gets very expensive with all the different accessories you need to buy, all the uh, maintenance that it requires. So, I think that's a huge waste of money. I'm not going to buy a special spray bottle just for my freaking glasses. So, what I do is I use non-alcoholic dish soap. Make sure that's non-alcoholic or else it can break through whatever it is that is um, coating your lenses. So, non-alcoholic is soft enough to still get rid of whatever fog may build up on old glasses, for example, um, making it cloudy, that's really useful to make them look brand new again when you can't afford a brand new pair every single year. This third hack, I'm gonna encourage you to be careful with this one. Um, it can turn real ugly real quick. I suggest you don't do this in public. Um, <laughs> I used to use this in the fifth grade when my eyesight just started going bad. Um, if you actually, Pull the sides of your eyes. I'm sure you're picking up on why you shouldn't do this in public. Um, if you pull the sides of your eyes, it creates a pinhole effect in that um, the light is coming into your eye in a different angle and causing your pupils to focus in a way that it's not doing naturally. So don't sit on the bus and be like, oh, where stop am I at? Don't sit in traffic and wonder, oh, what does that sign say? Do this in private when you're too lazy to pick up your glasses. This can get really racist really quickly. Protect yourself, protect your eyes, okay? My next hack is my favorite hack. Since I graduated school, lost my student benefits, no longer had student health insurance, um, I had to start getting cheaper. I had to start budgeting my money in a much better way. So glasses can often go anywhere from hundreds to thousands of dollars, depending on how expensive your taste is. I don't have that kind of taste when it comes to eyeglasses. I'll take what looks good and looks good to my bank account when I go online. So Furu.com is a very inexpensive online glasses shop. Super easy to use. Just upload your, your image 
and you can actually try on the frames virtually see what the frames look like on your face i used to be really afraid of buying glasses online because i want to see that it looks good on me before i purchase it so having the ability to see it before i purchase it is really useful these glasses are from Fermu. Um, with the ability to try them on online, I knew what they would look like before they even arrived. Um, they're the perfect prescription. They fit as well, which is yet another hack. If you look inside of the arm of your glasses, you can see the uh, size that you're wearing. So you can get the right width to make sure that, you know, it's long enough for your ear, for example. Um, you can also measure from the middle of one pupil to the left, middle of the next pupil. And that's going to tell you your pupillary distance. I believe that's how you say that, pupillary. Um, it sounds dirty, but it means uh, the distance between your two eyes to make sure that the frame is wide enough for the size of your face. Um, so they give you tips on how to measure and make sure that it's the perfect size. Upload everything, see what it looks like, know that it's the right prescription, and they ship worldwide. So I got these within like a week all the way out here in Dubai. So that's really cool. So the special treat to you guys, if you're watching this, you're probably like me and that you're, I'm not gonna say cheap, I'm not cheap. I am, uh, I am selective with whom I give my money. So Fashion Nova, Apple, RPG show, they can get my money, right? But the optometrist, the people that own all of the glasses companies out here, I am selective with them. So if you're anything like me and you too are selective with whom you give your money to, um, and you also have bad, bad eyesight, this is a great opportunity for you because Firmu is actually providing everyone who uses my coupon code a free pair of glasses. So not just the frames, not just the lens, you get the entire glasses. I'm saying this because often they'll give colds and it's just for the frames, for example, or it's just for sunglasses. You get a free pair of eyeglasses using this code until December 22nd, 2016. So go into the description box, um, follow the link, and you'll have an array of frames to choose from. Upload your picture, see what it looks like on your face before it even arrives, upload your prescription, Put in all of your measurements, like I told you before, and get a free pair of glasses in time for Christmas, in time for the end of the year. Start the new year with a new vision, regardless of who's in the White House. Also, it's a great gift for a loved one because Christmas is coming up. Treat your mom to a new pair of glasses. Treat your man to a new pair of glasses. So finally, I want you guys to tell me if you relate to me at all on the necessities that you have to buy but don't want to buy. Like, in addition to, to glasses, I hate buying toilet paper. This shit is expensive and literally goes down the toilet. Like, it, it's a ridiculous investment. Anyway, if you, <laughs> if you relate to me at all, let me know in the comments and get your free pair of glasses. Let me know when you buy them. Tweet me, let me know on Instagram, Snapchat, all those different places. I want to see what you look like on you and I want to know that y'all are taking advantage of free glasses. Check out for me, get your free glasses on it. Hey, take advantage. Look out for me in my next video. Get your stuff for free. Yes. Well done. <laughs> I don't know why I have to put that in. Was my necklace been here the entire time? I just have to interrupt this video real quick to say how annoyed I am. I'm looking over the footage and I see that my bra strap was showing the entire time. <sighs> Editing this is gonna suck because it's. Please ig ignore the bra strap, right? I'm. I